Crack the phrase, understanding, shell out. Hello, dear viewers. Today we're going to crack the shell of a very common English phrase, shell out. Understanding everyday phrases can be a challenge, but it's crucial for becoming fluent in English. Stick around to learn about where this phrase comes from, how to use it, and, importantly, what it really means when someone says they had to shell out for something. To shell out means to spend money, usually more than you want to or more than you expected. It's a phrase that suggests a sense of reluctance or discomfort at the amount being spent. But why shell? Historically, shells were used as currency in many parts of the world. So, shelling out gives us an image of someone handing over their precious shells, a form of payment. Now, we use it for any time we have to pay, especially with a hint that we're not doing so happily. Shell out is a casual phrase and is mostly used in informal conversations. You might use it when talking to friends about the high cost of concert tickets or discussing unexpected expenses. Here's how you might come across it. I had to shell out $200 for that car repair. Are you going to shell out for the new phone model? Notice that it's often followed by the amount of money and sometimes for plus the thing you're spending the money on. It can be used in both past and future tenses and even as a question when you're inquiring about someone's willingness to spend. Let's look at some examples to see how versatile this phrase can be. We had to shell out a lot for the wedding. Will you shell out for front row seats? He's always shelling out on the latest gadgets and gizmos. It's also common to use it when talking about situations where you feel money could have been saved, or the expense was somewhat unjustified. You can use shell out in various contexts from personal purchases to business expenses. However, the emotional undertone is generally the same, a mix of surprise and pain over the expenditure. It's not typically used for regular, budgeted expenses like groceries or rent, unless those costs have unexpectedly increased. Here are a few synonyms to help expand your vocabulary. Fork over, cough up, pay out, dish out, spend, these all carry a similar connotation of parting with your money, often begrudgingly. However, each phrase has its nuances, and, shell out, has its unique flavor of reluctance and pinch. That wraps up our exploration of the phrase, shell out. Remember, Learning phrases like this one can add color and authenticity to your English conversations. We hope this video helps you feel more confident in using shell out and understanding it when others do. Thanks for watching, and don't be shy to shell out a little time to practice what you've learned today.